All right, I've got a great product here for you. This is for all kinds of people. Um, this is an electric lunchbox, so it can run off of the traditional household plug-in power of, you know, 120 volt, but it can also run off of uh, DC systems or 12 volt systems like that of, say, a car. And that's one of the favorite things, as you can see, we're shooting out here in my truck, which, uh, you know, I basically live out of um, for work. Um, you know, and it's, it's, it's awfully hard to, to bring a meal because there's only so many sandwiches you can eat and you know eating out has uh, all kinds of costs with it and generally the food isn't that good anyways um, and maybe you don't have time to stop and deal with that kind of stuff so opening this up we've got ourselves a nice little uh, cooler box here that'll help keep stuff um, temperature whether that's warm or cold um, you know and we've got our lunch box here you can see um, it's got a little uh, steam vent on the top here it's got a little container for uh, some silverware uh, nice little handles, um, locks down with these four little clips, top comes off as you can see, seals well, it's got a little rubber gasket so nothing will leak out of it. Um, we've got our two different types of plug-ins, we've got our household power which is a traditional plug and then our uh, vehicle power here which would plug into say a, a cigarette lighter type outlet. Um, comes with these uh, nice two little uh, um, silverware sets here, some instructions and then of course the uh, nice stainless steel um, container that's going to be kind of your your heating area uh, stainless steel is wonderful because it is non-corrosive you're not going to have to worry about plastic getting into your food you can put anything in here from acidic foods to um, you know soups anything like that you don't have to worry about it flavoring and it's going to clean up real easy as well you know you can get right down to it comes with this nice little um, you know plastic uh, case maybe you want to keep stuff separate Maybe you've got um, a vegetable or a sauce or something like that you want to keep on the side. That fits in there nice and easy. Uh, this is about half a liter and this cooking container here is uh, 1.8 liters. So you can put a lot of food in there. Now comes for the, uh, the fun part. Um, when you have your food ready for you and everything, um, <clears throat> you've got your little DC outlet here. We're going to plug this in and we're going to plug in the... Uh, car here and it has two plug-ins one for the car and one for the uh, um, house or whatever so once you do that in about 30 to 40 minutes you're gonna have food that's gonna be about 140 to 160 degrees Fahrenheit um, or 60 to 70 degrees Celsius for those uh, metric folks out there um, while the food is heating up of course you're gonna leave the the sides here closed simply hit the little steam vent that prevents any uh, steam or any buildup um, from happening and, and causing you know the lid to pop off on you but um, with that you're going to have you know a hot ready meal that you've made yourself and prepared you know what ingredients are in it um, it's going to be far healthier for you and far cheaper so with that i highly recommend you guys check this out this could be for any type of an office setting where you're bringing your own lunch um, this could be for, for friends and family maybe you know somebody who travels a lot like i do and uh, you want to give them that wonderful gift of a nice hot fresh meal um, this is the way to do it